Welcome to another vlog, everyone. It's a beautiful, beautiful Saturday in Seattle. It's about 9 a.m. and I'm on my way right now to get my second COVID vaccine. We have a barbecue with my family planned later today. Probably we'll go like get some stuff for the barbecue. We still have to get breakfast because we didn't get that yet. We were also earlier talking about how a few people left some comments on my past videos of like why Yoni's never driving. And then I think I showed him driving in like one video and everyone was like, oh my God, Yoni drives. And I think that's really funny because like if Yoni was always driving in all my videos, nobody would question why I'm not driving. It's literally just because I'm a girl and I'm the one that's driving most of the time. And the reason for that is literally that this is my car. So I'm gonna drive my own car. Simple as that. We're going to the market. So we got oh, Alga's yeah. favorite bag. I with love all the holes. So if you put a banana in here. It's not gonna fall out. It's gonna fall out. Babe. No, it's not. Okay, we'll see you guys in a little bit. Welcome back everyone. Uh, we're on our way to the market. We were gonna go get some breakfast tacos, but they don't open until like 11. Correction, breakfast burritos. Sorry, breakfast burritos, but they also have breakfast tacos. Yes, Yoni's driving everyone. <laughs> We just parked, we're at the um, we're at the farmer's market right now. I'm just waiting for Yoni to get his shit together so we can go. You ready? Yeah. Are you cold? Yeah, a little bit. Weirdo. We're trying to get it out. Thank you. Thank you. I might yeah, be coming back here again and grab another one. We are here, okay. yeah. Okay. Line right now getting waiting to get some tomatoes we got some asparagus in here everyone went to the farmers market we got a bunch of stuff for grilling later right now we are getting breakfast we got some coffee Yoni's over here I'm over here Ow. Oh. Oh, Yeah. <laughs> All right, y'all. We're gonna do a farmer's market haul. I'm just gonna show you what I got real quick. All right, first we got some mushrooms. They didn't have any like classic like portobello mushrooms or something, but they said that these mushrooms would be really good grilled. I don't wanna rip them, so I can't show you. Or, um, I think blue oyster mushrooms or king oyster mushrooms, something like that. A few tomatoes, really beautiful like heirloom tomatoes. Um, we got two bunches of asparagus. I got my mom some radishes because she literally eats them like chips. She's obsessed with radishes. And then I got some of this local made organic lobne. I hope that's how you pronounce it. I asked how you pronounce it because I've had this before and I just didn't know how to pronounce it. So I kind of went around pronouncing it. But it's this like thick Middle Eastern yogurt for um, of these rhubarb stalks because I'm gonna make dessert when we get to my parents and I'm gonna make a strawberry rhubarb crisp and then we got some pastries that we kind of forgot about it's like a poppy seed strudel or yeah strudel right strudel yeah strudel strudel yes strudel a cherry strudel this one is like super thin but I'm excited I love cherry stuff and I never eat cherries and I feel like I should you know, eat them more. But I'm so full from that burrito, like I can't eat any right now. Cardamom bun. 
looks like this. And we got this beautiful potato biscuit. You want to try it on right now Smell on camera? It. Can I take a bite yeah. on camera? Actually, no, I'm so full. Just like taste it, you know? I don't have no space. It's fucking incredible though. Berry pocket. It has like berry jam in it and it's got all this like sugar on it. Yeah, we're just gonna like kind of like chill for a little because it's actually really hot outside, which I love, but it's like when it's hot, I feel like you get tired faster. Yeah, you gotta know? change all of this. Probably gonna work on some stuff, maybe like finish up my thumbnail. It's so freaking hot, bro. Like, I'm sweating. Seattle doesn't know how to deal with this type of weather. But anyways, guys, we are headed to my parents. It's literally 70 degrees. 70? That's it? That's it. Yo, I'm so hot. We're acting like it's 90 right now. But it's also because I'm wearing, like, sweatpants. Just because I love wearing sweatpants. But I am sweating. And I did not put on deodorant. That's not good. Oh, that's what that smell was. We are officially at my parents' home and uh, the grill is like currently not working so we're trying to figure out what's wrong with it. You thought I was on the phone? <laughs> No, I'm just talking to my friends over here. I'm gonna make the strawberry strawberry rhubarb crisp so that that's done. And then, um, yeah, we gotta figure out if the if the grill's not working or not. And we're, uh, we've just been working on getting some veggies ready. So we have some asparagus, some red onion that we put some olive oil on. We have some oyster mushrooms I got at the market today. Never had them before. Yeah, I've actually never had them before. A lot of people, a lot of like vegan people use these to make vegan like fried chicken and they bread it and stuff. And apparently it tastes really good. I put some like garlic onion seasoning, whatever and we're just gonna grill it and see how it comes out. We have a bunch of other veggies that are on the grill. Mm -hmm. Excuse me. This is some lollipop chicken, which is my brother's expertise. And then this is some zucchini. It's like too white to see it right now. A lot of people request that I speak some Romanian, so I feel like from now on in the whole video, I should just speak Romanian. Do you want to start now? It's kind of weird. <laughs> One, two, three, go. <laughs> One, two, three, go. <laughs> I have nothing. <laughs> Uh, you want to Bine. Da? Da. Ce bei? Bine. Bine. Ce bei? Oh, uh, uh, beer. Bere. Bere. Deci deja am făcut niște asparagus cu niște zucchini. Asparagus. Arată destul de bine. Ce ne-ai Și aici am făcut niște... Nu știu de ce ne-ai Fuck, I forget. Oh. How do you call this shit? Oh. Wait, no. Uh, ridiche, ridiche și ar, ardei. Ardei roșu. Uh, Hai, da, cum zice, la ardei. <laughs> Niște ridici care n-am mai mâncat înainte, făcute la grătar, așa că o să fie interesant. Și acum așteptăm să se facă carne, deși pe mine mă interesează carnea, aia aștept să fac restul. Și <laughs> All right, interesting. <laughs> interesting. Uh, we have lollipop chicken here, everyone. I've had it before, but let's just do a taste test. It's pretty good. I would give it like an 8 out of 10. Oh, really? Uh -huh. It could be a little saltier. I would give this a little saltier. Some oyster mushrooms and 
What would you rate it, Eric? 10 out of 10. Mm. I don't know, I have not- Oh so my god. Sugar. You're honestly so- I would never believe that it was gonna taste like this. So good, right? You know 10 out of 10. This is my strawberry rhubarb crisp with a little side of ice cream. And I already took a bite, but I'll just take a fake new bite again. <laughs> Mmm. Mmm. <laughs> Fain you, bud. No, it's actually really good. Yeah. Mom, what do you what do you rate it out of 10? Um, with nuts would be 10 out of 10. <laughs> My mom wants to put nuts on anything. She's, what? Not. She's obsessed with nuts. She would make that's a sandwich with it. bread and nut in that sandwich. She will eat that's so not true. Okay, without nuts, it's 9 out of 10. Yeah, Dad, really what good. do you rate it? He hasn't had it yet. Oh, he didn't even taste no. it yet. Hey. 9 out of 10. Just because it's a bit too sweet. Yum. Um. Eight and a half. 8.7. <laughs> oh my gosh. Okay. I, there was more like vanilla ice cream than. Okay. But we're not rating the ice cream with it. We're oh. rating just the thing by itself. Otherwise, it's like maybe like a nine. <laughs> and then he's like, otherwise, I think it's like a seven. <laughs> oh, wait, <laughs> what? Yeah, for what? Guys, it's Barb Chris was delicious. For the rest of the day, we're kind of just going to chill, probably read my book, do some homework that I have to get done. We're currently just like rolling some, rolling some, running some errands. I can roll some errands. You want to roll some errands? We're going to go get some hand soap. <laughs> when somebody says we're going to go get some hand soap, you know you needed that shit. Like, you know you specifically need that. Yeah. That's right. <laughs> We're back home. We just came back from Trader Joe's. We went to get soap, which we did. And we ended up with two full bags of groceries because that's just what happens when you go to Trader Joe's. But I got a few goodies that I'll show you guys. First, Yoni got these pretzel bagels and he made me a mini sandwich with a little bit of the pretzel bagel and some salami because that's just the European side of us. Mmm. It's actually really good. Mm. You gotta heat up the thing though a little bit. No. Yo, the shit is actually really good. I know what I'm doing, dude. The next thing, Yoni loves these, the sweet potato gnocchi. Gnocchi? Gnocchi with butter and sage. They're, they got some heirloom tomatoes that we're actually gonna have for lunch later. It's some focaccia bread that looks delicious. We also got these everything ciabatta buns, nice. ciabatta rolls. Nice. Then we got some boursin. How would you say this? Boursin. Said it right. Boursin. 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 For, all, for all the French speaking people. Would you say boursin or boursin? You, you over pronounce the R, like you overdo it. Okay, boursin. <laughs> Wait, you say it? Boursin. 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 Okay, whatever. Delicious cheese. And then we got a bunch of these. Y'all know, y'all know how much we love them. Then I got this new thing that I haven't tried before. It is organic toasted coconut granola bark. Gluten-free, crunchy granola layered with dark chocolate and sprinkled with toasted coconut chips. I'm not a big fan of coconut, but the picture here looks really good, so. Are they good? It's pretty good. It's not like amazing. I'm like craving something sweet and I don't have anything. This would come in, it would come in clutch, you know? Next, I got this spicy chakri mix. Crunchy, spicy Indian style snack mix. And I've seen it for so long and I was like, I wanna get it. And I didn't, I just never got it. So I was like, today's the day. Let me just try it out. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Mmm, it's actually really good. Chakri mix is actually fire. I'm gonna give this a 10 out of 10. I feel like people think I'm exaggerating because yeah. I have the same reaction. I'm just like, mmm. Should really 
does it every time every, anything is good. She no, it's just so automatic. Shit. Yeah. Then I also got this jalapeno limeade. I tried to get this last year, but by the time I found out about it, it was gone because it's seasonal. It's lime juice beverage with a kick of jalapeno. I think it's really good in the sense that it does have like a nice spice to it, but it's not sour enough. Like I want my limeade or lemonade to be like sour. Yeah, and this is not sour. So I'll probably add like my extra lime juice to this, but it's really good. Can't forget the number one item. Yeah, what's the number one item? This is a chai from Trader Joe's. Shout out to Trader Joe's. If you're watching this, please um, sponsor our family. Like, let's do something. You know, we can we can work it out. <laughs> These macaroons. You have fig, lemon, apricot, coconut, pistachio, and salted caramel. So I'm gonna have one because I've been craving these for a minute now. I think I saw like a video or something of like how to make macaroons on Instagram and. They looked so delicious and I just uh, craved one. On Instagram. On Instagram. Oh, wait. Oh, these are so good. Have you ever had macaroons or macaron? Here, have you ever had a macaron? No. Is that how you would say it? I never say that. Okay. I'm gonna have the apricot one. Look how cute. You mm. No, I feel like one day this summer, I will dedicate a whole video to trying to make macaroons. And the shit is like... What does it taste like? What is it? It's macaron. It's like a French pastry. A gustatory... What? A gustatory rainbow of French macaroons. What the fuck is gustatory? It's not a word. That is not a word in the French language. You guys are over me. Everyone, I know that um, I actually haven't turned on the camera. Or, well, you don't know, but I know that I haven't turned on the camera in hours. My heirloom tomatoes that I got from Trader Joe's earlier, I just sliced them. And I'm gonna put some olive oil on top. And when it's hot, all I want is just like fresh shit, like nothing cooked, you know? And then my favorite thing is this Trader Joe's also um, balsamic vinegar glaze. I actually don't really like using regular balsamic vinegar because it's very watery, but their glaze is perfect because it's literally a glaze, so it's thicker and it makes, it looks pretty, but it also just stays in place and it doesn't like get everywhere. And you're probably like, Alia, this is your dinner. You're gonna eat just tomatoes, oil and... No. Do you even know me? That is not all I'm gonna do, okay? From Trader Joe's, and I put it in the oven for 10 minutes, and it basically cooked, because it wasn't all the way cooked, and it got nice and golden. This cheese that I also got from Trader Joe's today, it's literally the best. I used to have this thing in Romania called Almete. Almete. And it would come in this little, like, basket container, and it looked like exactly tasted like this cheese. It's very soft and I'm just gonna put it on here. This. Mmm. Just take the whole bite. Mmm. So good, right? As I'm chewing, yeah. my mouth is watering. So yeah, it's gonna be dinner, guys. A little bready bread, a little cheesy cheese, a little tomato tomato. But yeah, I'm gonna end the vlog here. I do have homework that I need to finish, so I that's what I'm gonna do for the rest of the night. This video will be posted on a Sunday, and I'm actually filming this on a Sunday. So I'm right here with you guys, except a little bit in the past, but you know what I'm saying. Just know that we're in this together. If you have the Sunday scaries, you'll be totally fine. Okay, let's start the sun, the, the Monday and the week in a good positive energy. I mean, look at this, guys. Look at my new bouquet. It's so freaking stinking cute. Who says stinking cute? Like, jeez. I love you, and I will see you in the next vlog. Bye.